All right, so we got the Arcetti pasta, the Checo. That's my favorite. I've been getting this. It's the uh, semolina. Uh, very little with other ingredients, you know, semolina, and I love the Checo pasta. But there we go. And I uh, give that a good stir. I don't put I don't put salt in the water. I don't put can't put salt. I don't. It just goes down the drain. I don't put oil in the water. So uh, here's what we're gonna do here now for the uh, chicken breast. Get yourself a you know a couple doubled over uh, plastic wrap. Put another one on top. The flat side of the mallet. piece and fold it over. And uh, waste not want not. Don't waste the plastic wrap. Everything's a priority these days, you know, and you know, you know before all this uh, tragedy we had with this coronavirus, you know, just like waste, there's so much waste going on and people, this is going to force people to really start conserving and that's why we're doing some recipes that are cost effective and uh, we'll be right back. All right, so I, what I do is I like to do this with my pasta when it's like three quarter cooked. I lay, we lay it on a sheet pan and no, no, uh, you know, we don't put any kind of uh, oil on it, so it ends up not sticking to each other. And then when you reheat it a couple minutes to bring it up so it's tender, um, it, just, it, still, it still stays al dente. Now we let it cool down right at room temperature. That's it. We'll just put it off to the side here. Then we're going to start our rasta pasta. Um, I don't have all my supplies here because it's uh, we're kind of all shut down. This side's kind of shut down, but we'll be right back. So here we go. We're going to go with the rasta pasta. Um, get some butter, olive oil, a little blackened seasoning, and here's the, here's the other one here, some of uh, Rasta, rasta pasta, see, uh, uh, jerk, jerk seasoning. 
And we're gonna do this without flour. Skillet nice and hot. Onions in at the same time. Okay. Then uh, I'm going to slice up some mushrooms, kind of bigger chunks. Bigger slices. And we're also going to be putting some spinach in it, so we'll get that. Just nice fresh. Everything is nice and fresh. Put some tomatoes. Roasted peppers, some artichokes. We want to get a nice and like, uh, kind of like blackened, but um, Crank that fire up. We got our pasta ready. Ah, oh, smells good. I don't have the venom hood on, but. And uh, throw some peppers, tomatoes. Keep that heat on, you know, evaporate, evaporate down the moisture. Mushrooms. We'll put a little bit more jerk seasoning in there. I love this stuff. I put it in everything now. Now Lakeisha bought this home the other day. It got a little bit of heat to it. Try to make your own. Coriander spices. That will give you much. Yeah. Some heavy cream. So now we'll put our spinach in. So, you know, a little bit of chicken goes a long way. Feeding the family. Some artichoke hearts. You got a little bit of Parmesan. So 
we're just gonna like slow cook it here a little bit. Let it simmer down. Get a little taste for seasoning. Always got to take one for the team. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Really good. But um, in my opinion, needs a little bit of red pepper flake. There's a little bit of red pepper flake. Unfortunately, no, no uh, green pet, no uh, green onions. Well, we're slipping, but here's our rasta pasta. Taste the, the amount of heat that you put in. Let it let it settle in for a little bit because it's cooking in there right now, and it's got a nice little bit of heat. And with that uh, jerk seasoning, it's awesome. But uh, we're doing okay. We're, you know, we're uh, like I like to say, we're we're uh, better off than most, I would say, right now. And we're uh, worse off than few, you know. So we're we're counting our blessings. Um, if you wanna, you wanna, um, we just started a Patreon account. Uh, become a member of uh, of Cooking with the Blues, um, and uh, it's on uh, uh, Patreon slash uh, forward slash dot com. Cooking with the Blues. Uh, we're doing a little bit of charitable work here, as long as we're going to stay open. We're, we're you know seeing how it goes day to day. Uh, being Justin or down here, we're uh, practicing that uh, social uh, distancing. Um, sheltering in place, you know, but you know, we got to get out. We got to do a little bit. We were out yesterday to took uh, Axel for a run and uh, you know, we're uh, man, the, we went to this beautiful park and uh, some purple, I mean some uh, pink tree was in full bloom and daffodils starting to come out. Nature is still carrying on and uh, there's no reason why we can't uh, also uh, get away from the electronics and uh, do the best we can, but we wish you all well, uh, stay healthy, and when this is all done, we'll be back, you know, doing recipes a little tough right now, because like this box is shut off, and we got a lot of refrigeration that's emptied out and shut off, and I'm used to having everything at my disposal, kind of winging it, and, uh, but, you know, the bottom line is the recipe came out really good, and, and um, he tried and make the variation yourself, you can put some crushed tomato in there if you want, uh, whatever you like, if you have vegetables around the house, um, clean out your ice box. That's kind of what we're doing here, just working out of the ice box. But God bless you all. Daddy Jack's cooking with the blues. Uh, we wish you all good health. Stay happy. Get cooking. Do some artwork. Do a painting. Uh, make some music. Listen to some music. Read a nice book. Get your mind somewhere else because we sit down in one place and we don't keep our mind active. Uh, we start to get in, in a bad place and Got to, got to think positively, and it's self-preservation, you know, and those are your friends and your loved ones. Uh, peace. Mmm.